the Claremont Club's mission of bringing value to the community by being a community giver is one of the things that differentiate the club from the rest. Here's what CEO Mike Alpert has to say about the club's involvement in the Living Well After Cancer program. I believe that our community outreach programs has really been the single biggest morale booster and the single uh, biggest team builder that we've ever done. I think we become and have become the employer of choice in the, in the facility, the health club of choice in the communities we service. And I think those come to us in ways that aren't necessarily um, measured by bottom line dollars. The Living Well After Cancer program is a catalyst in many ways that impacts not only the cancer survivor, but family members too. Listen now to cancer survivor Deneen Riley and CEO Mike Alpert as they talk about why the program makes such a meaningful impression on so many people. I was um, diagnosed on September 11th last year. I found out about the Living Well After Cancer program through the Cancer Center at Pomona Valley Hospital. It sounded wonderful. It came in a perfect, perfect time in my recovery. I had a release from my doctor, but I hadn't really resumed um, kind of outside socializing or um, exercise or anything like that. So this was just a really good catalyst in healing. With the Living Well After Cancer program, the program is free to the participant the significant other spouse and the children. It's a 12-week program. It uh, is an opportunity for us to help people that struggle with a disease that is debilitating and life-threatening and really, really uh, challenging for not just the woman that's struggling with it, but her children and her significant other. The program took um, some burden off my husband, Michael, so that he could kind of release taking care of me, know that I will see that I could do it, see that there were people out there that could help me do it as well. And I have met absolutely amazing people and become very open to that I need other people. The support group I go to, I need to go there. I appreciate what they have to say and um, it's encouraging and it's educational and it's supportive, it's, it's all of those things. The consensus by the mass, mass majority is that they are extremely grateful to have, the, to have had the program, that it's helped immensely with the way they, they view themselves physically and emotionally. And it's uh, given them faith and hope and a real belief that they're getting better and that they're beating this terrible disease of breast cancer. It is really what got me out of the house. Um, uh, the surgery, I was down for six weeks and then I went back to work. And so a recovery and work took up all of my energy. And to get back out there with this new look on life, with this new body, it, I needed a little nudge. I needed a little nudge to go, to keep going, to get back to the things I liked. And um, so that it was very powerful in that way, it really was. To, to have an environment created that you were excited about going to at a time when you really need to take that next step. So I think the ability to be able to come into the club and have some fun time in an exciting, electric, inviting environment instead of in a sick care environment is a major, major, major uh, relief and benefit for these people.